know everyone probably wants me to do a little cute look book where I'm like, this is outfit one, this is outfit two, and then I'm pairing it with these shoes and this fucking bag. No! What up my dudes, Editing Claire here. I wanted to pop in real fast before I started this video to preface that you guys were never supposed to see this. I had every intention of making this a wholesome fashion video where I showed you all the clothes I was packing for my trip. Instead, your girl has rampant ADHD and she forgot to take her meds. I ended up having a full-blown conversation with myself for over an hour and a half spewing absolute nonsense. I'm not going to promise you a good time but enjoy. What's up my dudes, it's your girl Claire, and today we're going to get packed and ready to fly out of New York City, baby. Where are you going, where are you going? Oh, you know, you know. I'm just gonna go see this person, yeah, yeah. Listen, before you start asking who is it, who is it, just calm your little titties for a second. Where was I going with this? Oh right, I gotta pack. Am I the only one that overpacks because I just think of different scenarios in my head that could happen? and it somehow gives me a little of anxiety enough to be like, well, I have to just pack that just in case this happens, right? For instance, great example. Um, the whole entire week, it's going to be in the 90s. 90s. Tell me why I thought in my little head, hey, hey, what if you get cold? Excuse me, bitch? When will I get cold in 90 degree weather? But what if? Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Let's continue on with the show, oh boy! Ha ha ha! My neighbors probably think I'm insane. They don't know I'm making a video. I'm making a video, by the way, I'm not crazy. Or maybe I am a little bit. Can I give you guys a little bit of tea about my next door neighbors? They will never see this, so I literally don't care. And even if they do, <laughs> They are toxic in the least sexiest way possible. And I hope they hear me because these walls are thin. They fight constantly. There have been many a times we've just been chilling and all of a sudden we just hear rage yelling from the other side of this wall. Listen, I'm all for fighting, but fighting with your significant other to that degree constantly, break up, break up. What is the problem? It got to the point where my roommates and I were considering writing a letter to them, being like, yo, I don't know what's going on, but y'all either need to A, do couples therapy, or B, just break up. Like, understand the allure of finding somebody and then finding cheaper rent in New York City, but you are ruining everybody's life flashbacks of my parents fighting before the divorce oh my god mom dad stop fighting jeez i can't go to bed just sign the divorce papers already you do not know how to effectively communicate without raising your voice at each other come on guys that's not healthy that's not healthy we know this to be true um unbeknownst to me all my dresses have disappeared we're just going to cry in a corner where are they I just spent a solid 20 minutes trying to look for them, and the only dress I was able to find is this one. Which is a really cute maxi dress I got at Aritzia. It has a really cool slit. Not only is she sexy with the slit, she is maxi, so should we have any event that would require me to look a little more quote unquote conservative or modest? As they say, Nani? maybe it's a little bit of a formal event. I can just whip this baby out and ka-chow, I'm there. I'm fucking there. Met Gala, baby, I'm there. Now, what are we going to do? Let's think about shirts. Look what I found in the laundry today. Anybody who knows what this is will know what it is. This is for the people I be with sometimes, sometimes. Y'all know what this is? For all the children who don't know what this is, I'll tell you. It's a mask that Olympic skiers use to train during the off season. In order to be an Olympic skier, one must be absolutely in tune with all of their senses. For this to be achieved, 
A lot of Olympic skiers like to ski with this mask on. They ski blindfolded because that's what champions do. That's, that's what, what winners, winners do. do. They do have a walkie-talkie or some sort of headset while they ski, thus this little gaping hole. And you can get this mask anywhere. Um, I bought this mask on Amazon for I think $10. It's honestly the best of the best, creme de la creme, the tippity top of the tippity top of training equipment in modern day sport technology. Oh, the sunlight hurts my eyes. In terms of just everyday lounging, let's get some sweats going. I will be packing these joggers. They're super cute. They're hella old, so I'm not quite sure if y'all could buy them anymore, but I bought it off this site called Misguided. I have a feeling that this video is going to be 20 minutes long and the large majority of this video won't even be me packing. It's just gonna be me talking to this camera and doing cool dance moves, maybe. Oh, 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 who needs to pack when you got moves like mine? Yeah, get into it. It's okay, you just have ADHD. This is the hoodie I will be packing. It's hot as shit because I made it and it says get pegged. And if you like this hoodie, you can def buy it off my site and I will link it below if you are down to get pegged. I, for one, lose things all the time. I lose my mind, I lose my clothes, and honestly, I lose my spirit every once in a while. Yo, does this not fit me anymore? I literally have no boobs. I have no boobs, dude. Like, nothing to hold this fabric in place. When will I find a fucking company that is like, you know what? We recognize that there are women that have nothing, that are as flat as an ironing board, and we wanna to cater to you. No one? All right, I guess I'll just continue suffering. Lit, lit, lit. Without further ado, let's get into what I'm packing. I know everyone probably wants me to do a little cute lookbook where I'm like, this is outfit one. This is outfit two, and then I'm pairing it with these shoes and this fucking bag. No! This is how I influence, okay? This is the one cohesive outfit I know for sure that I will be bringing. It's this tennis skirt. Is this a tennis skirt? It's just a pleated tennis skirt of sorts. It's a pleated skirt of something. And this top from Zara, yada dee yada da, okay, let's get it. My sweatshirt, get pegged hoodie. Again, what a vibe, what a look. She hot, she hot, she hot. We're bringing this duster jacket. Let's put this duster jacket on. Granted, it will be 90 degrees all week, but fuck it, baby, I wanna look nice. We can kind of look a little suspicious, but cool. Right? Like, who is she? What is she doing? Why is she wearing all of this? What is her purpose? What is her purpose? I'm going to bring this shirt with me. We're just going to put this on as well. Why not? Oh, man. What a fit. I don't even know what to title this video because I'm not really sure what's going on. We're having a ball, we're having a good time. So I'll just like put it around my neck. Also going to bring my pleather shorts. I love long shorts. These are not short shorts. She a little long, she a little long. Yeah, 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 we're into that. What a vibe. I look very cool. You don't know what fashion is. I obviously do. Look at me. I'm stunting. <laughs> they add the necessary pop of color, as one would say. This is a little hard. Okay, we're just gonna have it sit a little bit lower. It's cupping my butt cheeks. This is kind of getting a little ridiculous. I am so ready for hot girl summer. With that being said, 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Granted, it's not your typical fashion video. I hope you liked it. If you hated it, sucks to suck. I had a blast talking to myself. Ah ha ha. Like, comment, subscribe, click the bell notification so you get updates every single time I post. And with that, I bid y'all bitches adieu.